My name is Archana Gopalakrishnan. I am a postdoctoral fellow in the laboratory of Dr. Stephanie Vogel and we are located in the Department of Microbiology and Immunology with the School of Medicine at U Maryland. So our lab does exciting stuff. We study how um, viruses and pathogens interact with innate immune cells. Um, in this case, it would be influenza A virus. Influenza A virus causes infection in your airways, in your lungs, and these are all mucosal layers that are typically layered with a cell type called as epithelial cells. So it makes sense that this would be the first cell type that encounters any pathogen and this is the first cell type that would encounter influenza virus. So my research focuses on this specific interaction of influenza virus and epithelial cells and what does this do to the epithelial cells? Do they die? What happens to their functioning? What molecules do they release? whatever they release, what effect does it have on other immune cells such as macrophages which are known to have a very important role during influenza infection. These viruses undergo something called as mutations or changes that leads to different strains coming out every year. So it, it requires us to predict um, for the next season what strain would possibly cause an infection and then prepare a, va a vaccine for it beforehand. But nowadays the approach is also to look at host factors when, and when I say host I mean the human body. What is it that we make or functionally that could help in controlling the infection and can we prepare drugs or medications that can actually enhance this function in a host. So these are called as host directed therapies. So what I am studying, understanding the interaction of epithelial cells and a virus would enhance our knowledge and shape the way we treat influenza infection by actually enhancing this host directed therapeutic agents. This was an awesome opportunity to learn from a, a mentor with great expertise in this field and who's, who's been in this, in this area for like years and years. But I think most of all it's it's the interactions and the collaborations you start to develop once you come to this school of medicine which has a lot of people and I think that's the most most useful or fruitful experience is going to different seminars and hearing wonderful topics and research that happens in the field of immunology.